guys welcome to another video in today's video i'll be showing you guys everything you need to know about the new Arby bells boss and possibly where it could be so first you're gonna need to have all of the three bits so for the first one russo's resonator i think it's called you're gonna need to finish the one in super golf there's some videos on youtube i believe i have a video on it so make sure you go check that out if you don't have it already and then you're also gonna need a, the secret piggy badge because you need it for the build a boat one so i recommend getting that one there's videos on youtube unfortunately i didn't show a video about that then um you need one for arsenal which also you need to have the badge that allows you to walk on water for build a boat so you need to have the piggy and the arsenal secret badge for build a boat i did make a video on arsenal one one so definitely go check that out and then there's also another bit for sh shopping wars which is um pretty sh i don't know what it's called here i think it's called um it's just called the purple bit, okay. Um, you get the purple bit from Shopping Wars. You have to do like a little boss fight against Bob, I'm pretty sure. And then the final one is in Build a Boat. We have to do another boss fight versus like a computer guy. And that's actually probably going to be the hardest bit to get. Pretty sure the easiest bit is in Super Golf. So once you get all, all three of those bits, you should be set. And all you have to do is just come over here to like... Um, Mr. Boingsworth lab, I'll show you. So basically, right next to the Hall of Fame, there's this little hole right here that you can go into. And once you go into it, you know, basically just follow the pathway until you see like this little like rocket. And once you see the rocket, turn to the left and there's like a secret tunnel right here. And once you go in, type in the code, um, it, a little thing will pop up and there's like invisible wall so you like can't get through so you need to have the code that you someone else can't open it for you you need to input the code seven two and eight seven so one two three four five six seven eight and then two i mean three twos and three sixes and then three more threes once you do that it should be approved and you should able to you should be able to go up the the elevator if you can't do that you could always just do the obby which i'm not the best at um but basically it's pretty easy obby you're supposed to jump over the wind tunnels which is also very easy and basically just complete the obby it's very easy but once you do that you want to make your way all the way over here and this is where mr boings with lab is there used to be a glitch where you're able to like um get in uh, uh, like a like you able to no clip like through a wall and you're able to get in here and once you get in here mr boing with will be sitting right here and uh he'll say this message if you already did all the bits or if you gave him the bits but if you haven't gave him the bits yet um you'll get like all these the Russo, Rusin, or like di different type of things that you can put on your avatar, like a gu uh, Sabrina's guitar, a mic, and I'm pretty sure Ru uh, DJ's drums. So once you have that, you're all set for the first step. Also, this may aid you in your obby, but you could try and get a boost, like from right there. Yeah, and, you, and then you have a boost and you are able to just complete the obby much easier after you like you. You you glitch you you gl you glitch the the acrobats um, enabling system and I'm pretty sure you might have to join a new server if you because I don't think there's any other way to get up so um yes so once you leave and rejoin you actually uh, need to get two other items well it's not totally confirmed that you need these two items but i recommend getting it it's the magnifying glass and the uv flashlight i'm pretty sure you'll need to use uv flashlight because it's already used for like a purpose for the shopping wars bit code but how you get the piggy um which is the, fl the uv flashlight basically say in here for 60 seconds or a minute and a piggy will come out with the flashlight and all you have to do is kick uh click it with your mouse or whatever mobile and you ha should 
get it in your inventory and you're able to use it but and once you do that um you want to come over here it's sort of where the pet like mojo is and you want to go that floor too and you want to go into uh, sabrina's like little like where they do the commentary stuff and when you talk to her she'll give you a magnifying glass and with that magnifying glass is like a little secret that you could find um that it's like it basically says trust russo i mean trust russo not me or or don't trust me trust russo or what i have no idea i think it says don't trust russo trust me i'm pretty sure that's what it said and um and th that's like a little secret with the magnifying glass and once you do that, I'm pretty sure this is where the boss fight is. And you're also going to need all the badges. So I recommend getting all the badges um, before the boss fight. So you can try to get the like the golden crown of courage or the champion's thing. Or the champion's like helmet. So I have all the badges that are available so far. And all that's left is the Build Boat Jailbreak and the Mount Everest one. So once those are completed, those should be unlocked. And you should be able to do the boss fight. Maybe you have to, maybe the finale uh, video has to come out. But all you have to do um, is do those uh, badges and you should be good. For the next thing, you actually have to have the, um, the outer city or these backpacks. You've probably seen something about these backpacks before. But um, you enter this like changing room type of thing. And you're able to purchase different backpacks. And the best one costs 10,000, or yeah, 10,000 uh, battle coins, which is very expensive, but it may take a little grinding to get this. But I recommend trying to grind for this. And next is the different types of boots. I recommend getting all these boots because you like different d jump power. And I don't, I don't know what the, the um, there's different jump power um agility gravity and truth boots i don't know what the truth boots does but i recommend getting all of them just in case like for obby and probably that's going to be in the boss fight so you want to take off in this like uh this little jump pad here and i recommend f fully charging your battery pack because you're going to need the fully charge your battery pack to like get out here or in the Alice City, because whenever you go in the Alice City, it like removes some energy from your battery pack, and you get ba uh, you get like, um, 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 I can't think of it. Oh shoot, I couldn't think of it, but uh, you need to do battles to like you get XP and it fills the bar. So like, there's different battle like eggs and stuff that you could get, and there's like little chests around the map. But I'm pretty sure this is where the boss fight is. And, um, one thing is, oh, wait, they'll, I think they light up. I'm pretty sure they light up when you have the bits. So I'm pretty sure you just need to get some more, like, bits or something, or some type of thing. We need three more. So maybe it's more confusing than we thought, because I'm pretty sure this is where the, where the, it's like it's lighting up, which is a little weird. I think this is where the boss fight will be, and it'll teleport us to, like, a different game or something. And I don't know of any other spots where it could be, so... Um, that is pretty interesting. So let me show you guys one more secret. So if we leave the outer city here... So you know the subway code that I think I said earlier? I don't think I didn't. Uh, I, I don't think I showed you, but... There's a subway code that you know, where you type in Mr. Boingsworth code. There's actually another code that you could type in. Uh, I'll show the code on the screen. I don't know the code that is what the code is, but the code would definitely be on screen. And you type in that code, and the subway will get active activated, which is a little weird because no one knows what the subway is. So I found this little door right here. And I don't know if it has anything to do with the subway. Because it's like, well, a subway is an underground train. So I'm assuming this is where it could be. Because it's underground, like this building. And there's another spot that I thought it could be. Which is over here. It's under this building. Let me just get over there. So if you go over to another Mr. Boingsworth hole where you could go through. Um, 
There's another like subway type of thing. Well, there's like they display the ho this is the Hall of Fame basically. I think this is the Hall of Fame, but it's open. And I don't. I'm pretty sure it's a coincidence that they're uh, both under like the the door to Mr. Boingsworth. But I don't know if that's a coincidence or not. So um, that's pretty interesting how they're both at the Mr. Boingsworth like entrance to his to his little lab here. And also, uh, earlier I was talking about the glitch where you can glitch into his lab. It's actually right here. They put a troll face, um, which is, it could, well, that is creepy. It can see through my, my, my life. So weird. But I used to be able to, like, no clip through the wall of the ground here. But I guess they patched it. So that, that's pretty sad because that was a fun little glitch. Like, you had to do some exploring, exploring and stuff to get under there. That was, like, so fun to do. Because it, it, it kind of took a long time to figure out, but which was a little cool. So that was a little secret there. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video or live stream. And also comment down below if you want to see any other Ubi Battles content. Bye-bye!